Welcome back to Advanced Answers. If you are enjoying our videos, please like us and subscribe to our channel. How to prevent hair loss for men. Hi, I'm Mark Lucas, Clinical Director for Advanced Cosmetic Surgery and Laser Center's Hair Loss Division. Thank you for tuning in today where we are going to tackle a very important subject for how to prevent hair loss for men. If you have hair loss, you will want to know what can be done for thinning hair and to how to prevent the hair loss for, for men. We've all seen commercials for Keeps and for him, and we soon realize there's not really a hair loss cure out there. But while there are a lot of gimmick de gimmicky devices, procedures, and supplements, each of them promising to be you know, the, the next big hair loss cure, there are really only a few things that really work well especially if you have, you know, a, a, a receding hairline. So I'm going to reveal some hair loss treatments that even though are not a baldness cure, if you want to keep and strengthen the hair that you have, plus save follicles that have not yet dried up, listen up. Number one, really important, you need to build a proactive plan that really works for you. And there are four options that you should consider if you are wondering how to prevent the hair loss. And they, and they all work to stimulate regrowth on weak miniaturized follicles. Finasteride, commonly known as Propecia, blocks formation of DHT. DHT is a male androgen hormone which contributes to hair loss by making hair follicles thin and small. We call that miniaturization. As a result of this disruption, the hair goes into a longer resting period which makes the hair stop growing. So by, by basically blocking the absorption of the DHT, finasteride helps promote hair growth. Minoxidil, which you might recognize by the print patented name Rogaine, is available over the counter now. By massaging it into your scalp twice daily, it increases blood flow to the follicles. The hair grows fuller and less likely to surrender to the permanent fallout. It boosts the follicles also during the regrowth phase. It's particularly effective on the crown of the head, which is back here. It performs, it will promote uniform thickness, but it isn't an effective defense against receding hairlines at the temples. Both finasteride and minoxidil are available online through companies like HEMS or through your local MD. LLT laser caps are, are based on the concept of low level, level laser therapy. It's a proven technique for slowing down hair loss, strengthening, strengthening those existing follicles, and boosting hair growth. Many different brands, such as Capillus and Agro, have, however, we prefer this original laser cap made by a group of doctors in Cleveland, Ohio. Lifetime warranty, no other product does that. It's FDA clear to promote hair regrowth in both men and women with pattern hair loss, and it's only available through your doctor. PRP, what is PRP? PRP uses platelets in your own blood to stimulate regrowth. The first step in getting PRP is having your blood drawn, which I don't like, but then it's spun in a centrifuge, and then for the best results, you should do it basically once a month for four months. It can come with a high cost. Single treatments can run $1,500 or more, so be prepared. In closing, seek guidance as soon as you notice a change in your hair. If you, if you want to fight hair loss, you need to visit an MD that understands the hair loss process at the first sign of thinning or shedding. Getting treatment for hair loss in its early stages can help minimize over, overall hair loss and increase the odds of hair loss treatments working to its full potential. Hair loss can seem overwhelming, which is why it's necessary to consult with a hair loss specialist who will assess your condition and explain all of your hair loss treatment options. Hey, as always, thanks so much for watching. If you found this information helpful, please click the like button and subscribe for more information on this topic.